welcome back to the channel guys how's everyone doing today i'm doing good we got the freshly paved road hell yeah dude oh yeah dude all right uh today's topic uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna go over uh what it costs to own a sport bike or my ninja 400 2019 but first uh got some news baby got some news you gotta update i gotta keep you all updated um so let's see uh i just changed my baby's oil and her or in the filter hey let me you guys gotta let me know if you want you want to see a uh like an an oil change or a filter and like like a like how to do it like a diy kind of kind of type video y'all just let me know all right Let's hop into it, shall we? Alright, so first I'll talk about I'm gonna talk about how much I paid for the bike. So I got it with uh eleven hundred miles. So basically brand new. It was a 2019. I already said that. The dude beat the previous owner dropped it once. There's a little bit of scratches on the side. It, it's hard to notice, so it's not that big of a deal. But yeah, so that was that was 5,600. I tried to deal them deal them down at the dealership, but it was during like COVID and shit, so they were not there. There's like barely any wiggle room. But yeah, so I got her for 5,600. Not bad though, not too bad. No oh, insurance for me. I mean, it, it's gonna insurance is gonna vary for. It depends on like you know how many tickets you've got, if you got any accidents, everything like that. I've had shit. I got oh bug flew on my screen. So I have woo -hoo -hoo! woo watch out, buddy. Hey, yeah, see, I got gear on today, boys. You guys better be happy. I got gear on for you. It's hot out. I put it on for you guys. I saw a comment saying, hey, "Where the gear?" Yeah, so my I've had I have what I have five I have like four or five warnings I got quite a bit and why well, I got one ticket and my insurance is for the bike I think it's like like I think it's like 50 bucks 45 bucks it's pretty cheap um, yeah so for around a year insurance it's probably around like 700 bucks which really ain't that bad to keep it and I know as the cc's go up on the bike obviously the higher the insurance is gonna be I got an R1 that insurance has got to be like fucking 150 plus but yeah so that's the insurance on it it's not it's not terrible um gas literally takes what looks like two and a half gallons or some shit it has really good mileage though it's like fucking 55 miles plus a gallon probably probably more to be honest but yeah, um, it's besides the point. Gas is like what eight bucks a tank. Oh, I got I go to Costco, so gas is cheap as fuck there too. But either way, gas is cheap. So gas is eight. Insurance is like fifty five. The bike itself was fifty six hundred. Um, riding gear. Riding gear can get pretty expensive. No cap. Um, I got these little cheap gloves from from Amazon like 20 bucks they work good these just, it never stays velcro though i mean whatever so you always see me doing this shit I'm trying to pat that shit down on it just stay down bitch uh this i got an alpine stars jacket this thing's really nice though um this alpine stars jacket ran me up to like 250 bro So yeah, that was pretty expensive, but it's worth it though, cause like this is the, like this shit's the only protection you have if you go down. I don't have boots yet. Rocking the Sperry's today. Yeah, I know boots can get pricey as fuck too. Boots can be around like 250, 300 as well. I got a, I got an AGV K1 helmet. This was this was also 250. So the fucking just the jacket, the helmet alone is 500 bucks, and the gloves is 520. And if you get boots, I could run you up to like 700, 800. 
And I don't have riding pants. I usually just wear like, khakis or some long pants. Should probably invest in some pants too. But yeah, so if you really get if you really get in everything, like including the boots and the pants and everything, it, it could probably be around a grand just for gear. But like, it's so worth it because if you go down road rash, that shit ain't gonna be fun. I've seen pictures of that before. That shit sucks. But yeah, um, what else? We got the bike, the insurance, the gas. I like maintenance on it. I don't know, mate. Like I just did the the oil change. Took two quarts of oil. It was like thirty bucks. Um, the oil filter was like fucking like ten bucks. I mean, the maintenance is pretty easy. I mean, it's literally just the oil. Literally just the oil. Tires here and there. So yeah, I'll do a little recap for you guys. We got... We got the bike itself, 5600. Uh, we got uh, insurance. Around like 700 a year. It's like Probably around like in between 50 and 60 a month. I don't really remember. Uh, what's third? And then we got gas it's like 10 bucks every fill up then we got then we got the riding gear fourth um which can be up to we can, which can be up to a grand probably it could be up to way more actually just depends what kind of like gear you get but i already told you my gear it was around it was like 520 for everything for the jacket the helmet and the gloves but yeah so because like before i got a bike i was curious on how much insurance and all that shit was so I figured I'd let you guys know. Um, and yeah, road to 250. Let's go, baby. Come on. We're, good. We're still going out. We're at like 154 right now. That's the eight, boy. Um, so yeah, I appreciate all the love from you guys. All the comments, the likes. But yeah, I think that's pretty much going to be it for the video. If you guys liked it, let me know. Leave a thumbs up for me. I'd appreciate it. Uh, comment if you want. Try to answer your questions. And always subscribe, baby. You already know it. Subscribe. Subscribe for your boy. And yeah. Over and out, guys. Right safe.